you can't be free. Yeah, there is, is happening in social media. They put all kinds of label China as one of the worst countries, the addictive country, that country that they don't have freedom. But we are foreigners who are living here. We got a freedom. We do what we want to do. It's mind your business. Yeah. The studying method in the school and the study method in Saudi Arabia, mm-hmm. you guys have that kind of avenue to exploit the learning side of the teaching here. How do you see them? Is it almost the same or different? What are the differences between them? Um, I don't have that experience about like about how they teach here, but uh, as what I see now is is like. It's very really good the way how they teach. That's quite good. Okay, thank you so much for this insight and thank you for writing all this topic with us and uh, all the students out there that want to come to China to study. It's open country. They are open, not like what you see on social media. So what advice are you going to give to the people? Uh, I want to give them one thing is that when you come to China, you have to you have to uh, search about it before you come. You have to read about the rules because uh, I know some some friends of mine. They uh, they came here just to work, but they they come with, just with uh, with student visa, and the Chinese are and the and the rules are like. Okay. You don't have to. Yeah, as a student, you have to focus on your education. They make it clear that you have to focus on your education. Mm-hmm. If you are a student, you don't work. Yeah, of course. Yeah. very important. My dad always say, dress the way you want to be addressed. You know, in every country they have different culture and customs, especially China. China, their culture is different from any other country. Subscribe and keep the